Hi everybody, it's Beth, and today I'm making some candy corn decor. I used one of these foam cones from Dollar Tree, some of Dollar Tree's nautical rope, yellow, orange, and white acrylic paint, this little sign from Target, some Spanish moss and raffia, some different ribbons, and hot glue. I started by cutting off just the tip of that cone and then using my razor blade or box cutter and cutting it right down the middle. So it does make a little bit of a mess, but that's all right. So once I had it separated, I just took my blade and kind of smoothed it out the best I could, making sure it was as flat as possible on both of those pieces. And then after I finished up that, what I did was took the nautical rope and took sections of it and glued it along each of those pieces. And then I just glued a piece on and then cut off the end. And I did that all the way up each of those half pieces of cone. So once I got to the top, I just kind of rolled over that piece of nautical rope and just glued it to the top part of the cone and then cut off that excess piece of rope and then cut just a little strip of the rope and kind of tucked that excess piece right on the top just to make sure to cover the entire top part of that cone. So you'll leave the back of the cone where you had cut completely not covered because you'll be gluing that onto that sign and you'll do both of those pieces that way. So after I had both of those covered with the rope, I just took my yellow and I painted the larger part of the cone, the yellow. So I did about four rows up with the yellow and painted with the yellow color. And I just use a smaller brush just to make sure that it had my line nice and straight. And I did that on both of them and then just painted the end of the cone with the yellow color where I didn't cover it with the rope. And I just dried it a little bit to make sure that I didn't, you know, blend my colors when I moved on to my next color. So then I moved on to the orange. In this section, I did a little bit bigger, so it made it look like the candy corn. So I did the orange, much larger section on both of those. And again, using a smaller brush to make my lines nice and neat, and then went on to a larger brush to fill in the larger section. And then I moved on to my white once I had the orange filled in and again using the smaller brush to fill in the straight line and then filled in the rest of it with a larger brush. Did a much smaller section with the white. And 
then I painted the bottom of these the white as well. And then after I had them completely painted, I went back through and did a second coat. And I did use my heating tool to dry them a bit, but I did end up letting them dry for quite a while. So while they were drying, I went ahead and made a messy bow. I love these messy bows. So I just took different ribbons and pinched them in the center, crisscrossing them back and forth, kind of making a, them an X in my hand, crisscrossing them back and forth, mixing in some raffia in between, just holding them nice and tight in the center in my hand. And then once I had them nice and filled in, just took some twine, wrapped it around the center where I was holding it, and just tied a knot. And then trimmed up the excess in long pieces as I went and then fluffed up the pieces. And then once everything was dry, what I did was added some hot glue on the bottom of my sign, glued on the Spanish moss on the bottom of the sign, glued the candy corn pieces right above the moss, and then glued my bow right on top of those. And that's it. I think it turned out really adorable. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.